Well, hello guys, Letter Show TV here, and I guess this is a announcement video. Now, as you guys know, I had an Avengers stop motion series, and I had a Spider-Man series based around Far From Home. And I did finish the Avengers series. I actually managed to finish that series. It was called Avengers Outlawed, and it actually tied into the Spider-Man stop motion that I did based around Far From Home. And I want to continue that Spider-Man series. Recently, I got a ton of the newer Avengers-based sets. So I got a lot of the newer Avengers sets. You know, the ones with the AIM agents in them. And I don't think I'm going to use those AIM agents at all. I don't think I'm going to use them at all. I think I'm going to just make my own story and do that. And when WandaVision and the other Marvel Disney Plus shows such as the Falcon and the Winter Soldier come out, I'm going to connect those types of things onto Spider-Man, Spider-Man Aftermath, that's what the series was called, Spider-Man Aftermath, because it deals with what happens during Far From Home. And, of course, it's changed from the original movie. But I want to continue that. I have an idea. I'm not going to tell you exactly what it is because I'm developing it. It's an idea, after all. And it's going to be a little bit before I can, you know, get it into an actual stop motion. I have to script it the same way I do my Ninjago series or seasons. And uh, yeah, I have to script it and everything. And so that's going to take a little bit. And if you have not seen my Avengers Outlawed series, I will suggest that you go watch it because it's fairly okay. It's a short series. It's not very long at all, like five episodes, based shortly around Avengers Endgame and Avengers Infinity War and slightly around Spider-Man Far From Home is slightly around Spider-Man Far From Home, kind of. And, uh, yeah, it introduces Mysterio as a main villain and stuff like that. So, I can't wait to now edit these episodes, not in Windows Movie Maker completely, but in Premiere Pro and After Effects, because now I have After Effects and Premiere Pro. I didn't have... After Effects and Premiere Pro back when I made those stop motions and you guys can tell hopefully tell a clear difference between the stop motions that I made when those movies were coming out and now hopefully you guys can tell a clear difference from me using Movie Maker. Now I do use Movie Maker to add in the sound effects and you know, stuff like that. But I don't use it completely to edit things now. So, yeah, I just wanted to come on here and tell you that I'm thinking about reviving the Avengers series and Spider-Man series. You may never know, I could make an Avengers Outlawed Season 2 and I'm very excited for this because 
There's a lot of things I could do with this, potentially. And I kind of want to do things with this. So, yeah, that's what this video is about. I'm sorry if it's all over the place, kind of. But if you have enjoyed, please comment, like, and subscribe. You may notice in the back, I do have another shelf. I have developed a lot more sets. I've gotten a lot more sets in the last year. Despite the pandemic, I have gotten a lot more sets. So my room where I film has become a lot more stuffed. That means I have to put shelves somewhere else. So yeah, that's the deal with that. So please come like and subscribe and I shall see you in the next time and make sure that you watch my other channel Aquatic Let's Plays and Reviews for anything to do with Minecraft. Always link in the description. So see you next time. Bye.